Hugh, your first goal in the North Melbourne jumper, it was a beauty as well. Can you tell us about that? Yeah, it was, uh, it was better than my second attempt, that's for sure. Um, yeah, it's always good to get one um, early or but a pre-season game, so hopefully you can carry that over um, into the season. But uh, as a, I've always been a midfielder that can sort of go forward and, and kick goals, and with the personnel that we have, we'll be spending a bit of time up forward as well. So, it's, um, yeah, it's nice to get on the board nice and early. Awesome, mate. And it's our last hit out of the pre-season. How much do you reckon the team's learnt from today? Yeah, I think over the last two weeks we've, we've certainly learned a lot. Um, I thought there were some pr improvements clearly this week than the week before. There's some things that still quite, aren't quite at the level, but from where we were this time last year, we're, we're miles and miles ahead with some, some guys still to come back and some competition for spots, which is really exciting. So, well, as I said, we're in a far better position than we were this time last year, and I think we've already made some serious gains in the past couple of games. So, um, we've got two weeks before round one at the, at the G, so um, hopefully everything will start to come together around that time. And how valuable is it to spend time with this really young midfield group and kind of learn how they play and vice versa so they can learn how you play? Yeah, it's good. I like It's only my second game with this group and last week we were missing some key guys in LDU and Jai, so it was the first time that I've had an opportunity to, to play with those guys and then obviously work with Goldie next, so we're still figuring out how one another work and the timing and the cues and that happens when you, when you play games together. But it's very exciting and uh, I think that once we all get on the same page will we'll certainly do some damage um, across the competition. So. And what do the next two weeks look like in the build up to round one with training and preparation? Yeah well we're not we're not going to take the foot off the gas. We, as we said there's still some things that we need to work on in terms of our contestable and clearances and um, our compliance as well so we'll we'll break the game down and uh, while we took some positive things out of it there is still a lot of a lot of learning so at the end of the day we, we were fight within five goals of a team that played finals last year so um, Certainly some things to work on. We're not going to take our foot off the gas because we've still got two weeks around one and then obviously the big season ahead of us. Awesome, mate. Thanks for the chat and happy birthday. Easy. Yeah, cheers. See you again.